morning, neighbor, and welcome back to the Higher Grounds podcast. Thank you for joining me. Philippians 4, 6, be careful for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known unto God. There are three things we'd like to bring out in this verse. First of all, he gives us an admonition about anxiety. Be careful for nothing. The word careful deals with being anxious about something. And my, how anxiety has been magnified in our society today. The second thing is an admonition about asking God. He said, ask with prayer and supplication and thanksgiving. And so it's important to realize that asking God has power. God is interested in answering our prayer. The third is an admonition about appreciation. With thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. In other words, thank God in advance for what God is going to do for you. Anxiety is a terrible thing, and as pastors, we counsel people with anxiety all of the time. One writer said that anxiety is like a trench that is dug in the mind, which becomes this great cavern. And the longer anxiety is allowed to go unchecked, every thought of the man's mind and heart falls into the cavern of anxiety. We are told by psychologists that 40% of the things that we are anxious about never take place anyway. 30% of the things that we're anxious about are things that we can do absolutely nothing about anyway. 12% of the things that we're anxious about has to do with the opinions of other people against us, and we can't change their mind. Uh, 10% of the things that we're anxious about has to do with our health, and the longer we are anxious about it, the worse our health becomes because stress damages the body. Only 8% of the things that we're anxious about can we actually do anything about. But the longer we remain anxious and thought about it, the less we get up and do. So get with it today and do what you can about what you can. And God bless you, my friend. And I pray you have an anxiety-free day.